<laughs> Soccer 605, we're here with Nicole Hatcher with the Sioux Falls Roosevelt Girls. You guys had a nice season opener tonight. Tell us a little bit about that. Um, we played Brandon Valley, and we started the game off really slow. We had some bad first touches, but after they scored first on us, we really cleaned it up, and then we decided to finish some goals, and we ended up winning 6-1. to one. Speaking of goals, you collected a couple of those yourself in the first half. How'd that feel? That was pretty nice. I don't know. Needed to start somewhere, I guess. You always got to start every season. But it was nice being able to like, play other people for goals. It was really nice to, like, team effort there. And you guys um, did very well last year in the season in the tournament. And this year the, the coaches have you ranked as number three. How does that feel? I don't know. It sucks because obviously we think we're there. Like we want to be that number one team. Like we think we can be. But being an underdog is... Is that's okay too sometimes because to work from behind just makes us feel that much better. And sometimes it's nice not to have that target on your back. Yeah, exactly, like it's nice not being the team to like go out there and try to score on or just beat. It's nice just being able to win and get through, and then the tournament to really like step up and really take it. Uh, you're, you're, as long as you stay close to the top of the pack, right? Yeah. Um, Nicole, you're a junior now, so you have this year another year of, of high school soccer left. All state last year um, seemed to be turned on the goal scoring this year. What are your future plans for soccer after high school? Um, I really want to play college D1 somewhere. That would be nice. I really want to. I just want to see where I can go. I just want to see what my opportunities are. So I need to get out and just see what I can do. That's great. You guys have. Um, a few new players on the team this year. How many How many freshmen? We have three freshmen, the Beam Twins and Marissa. So we're working with them, and we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. And how many seniors did you lose? Last year we lost four, but Taylor Hembolt was out for most of the season with a collarbone. So it stinks because they were good seniors. They were really good players all around, with Carly going to Texas, Brenna going to USD for soccer. We just, we're really going to miss them next year for sure, this year, sorry. Well, you had a, a nice night of scoring goals, and you also were a very good provider in the middle of the field. I imagine you had a few assists in there as well. What's your favorite place to play on the field? I really, that's tough. I really like playing up top because I feel like I contribute the most to the team there. I feel like if I'm scoring, that's, that's doing what I'm on the field to do, so that's nice. But playing in the midfield is nice, too, to get those other players involved and really really like see what we can do as a team. Well, Nicole, we're looking forward to watching you through the rest of the season. Good luck to you, and thanks for chatting with us on Soccer 605. Thanks. Thanks.